town like in Southern California, where there seems to be a Tesla in every plot, the chances of pulling up next to a Model S P100D here near Malaga in Southern Spain are pretty slim. So it's easy to be smug when you're driving a 2018 Porsche Panamera Turbo SE Hybrid Sport Turismo. Use its launch control and Porsche says the plug-in hybrid can hit 60 miles per hour from a dead stop in just 3.2 seconds. I'm pretty sure we can take the poor soul and the aging Kia Picanto. From the looks of things we can take everyone. Here, the 86 horsepower Picanto has some balls. Porsche has been in the electrified car business for some time, but the going has been slow. The German automaker's best-known hybrid, the 918 Spider Hypercar, in 2013. About 1,200 were built. In 2016, Porsche sold just 2,504 hybrid Panamera ZKN in the United States, and that was a 66% increase over the year before. Well, here comes the onslaught. In 2018, Porsche will introduce six e-hybrid variants of the all-new Panamera, and a plug-in hybrid variant of the all-new 2019 Cayenne is coming. Sitting atop this lineup is the $188,400 Panamera Turbo SE Hybrid Sport Turismo, which will hit dealers this spring. The Sport Turismo is the wagon, or shooting brake, version of the Panamera, and it looks fantastic sitting on its 21-inch wheels backed up by standard carbon ceramic brake rotors and 10-piston front calipers, each the size of a small child. Long, low, and wide. Extra wide. Within the small white stucco villages that dot Malaga's hilly landscape, the Porsche looks like something from outer space. Or at least from the future. Locals look up from their cigarettes and drop their jaws, turning their heads slowly like they do in movies, pointing with fingers and phones. Women, wearing scarves, reach for their children. <laughs>